Hi, my name is Peter Rice. I'm a professor of clinical pharmacy at the University of Colorado Skaggs School of Pharmacy and Pharmaceutical Sciences. I want to talk today about cough remedies. Children often get coughs. It's a common part of childhood and parents have this natural urge to, to treat their children so that the children won't be suffering. Uh, for several years now, uh, in both the United States and in Canada, it's been recommended that cough products not be given to children. Uh, this may seem surprising to parents and may, may seem a little bit cruel, but when studies have been done, it, you know, what we found was that uh, children did not receive any benefit from cough and cold preparations, but generally carried a risk of, of some sort of adverse effect from taking those. Uh, the age at which cough medicines have, have been shown not to be effective uh, is up to at least the age of six. So it's recommended that children below six not be taking cough and cold preparations. There are some complementary and alternative medicines that have been uh, suggested for cough. One of these is honey. Uh, honey is a, a safe medication to be taken uh, by older children and has been shown to be somewhat helpful in cough. Doesn't really help the underlying problem any, but uh, some people find relief from that. Uh, honey is not recommended for younger children, uh, less than a year uh, young, uh, because there are bacteria in the honey that might harm the child. Uh, there are some things that parents can do for, the, for their children who have cough that are, are very safe and often are effective. Uh, uh, one of these is using a vaporizer or humidifier. Uh, vaporizer adds uh, uh, moisture to the air uh, through a, a heated mechanism. Uh, humidifiers add uh, uh, humidity to the air through a, a cool mist. Uh, some other uh, uh, things that parents may be tempted to use, one of these are topical products such as a, a Vicks VapoRub that is a combination of menthol and uh, uh, camphor. And th these often make the parents feel better but you know, these, as with cough and cold preparations, have not been shown to benefit the children in, in controlled trials. So uh, while it may seem hard as a parent to sit back and you know, watch your child with a cough or a cold, probably the best thing that you can do for them is to push fluids, you know, get some humidity into the air, and try and avoid medic medications if you can. When parents are considering whether to keep their child in bed or not, a lot of the things that we do for, for cough and cold are symptomatic relief. They're meant to make the patient feel better. So if your child wants to stay in bed, that, that's, that's a great thing to do. Uh, but if your child wants to get up and play, you know, there, there should not be anything wrong with that. It shouldn't affect how quickly they get all over their cough or their cold. Uh, often children just wish to uh, stay in bed and have some nice chicken soup and you know, that's, that's an age-old remedy that uh, seems to work very well.